Hi there. Now for this first question, we had to work out the probability of A, which was the event, the probability that Z was greater than 1.1. And you can see the answer turns out to be 0.136 to three significant figures. So as usual, what I'll do is I'll take you slowly through the work solution, although you might want to fast forward to skip that. Okay, so for a question like this, what I'd want to do is just sketch the standardized normal distribution. Z following a normal distribution with a mean of zero and a variance of one. So we're looking for the probability of Z being greater than 1.1. So if I was to mark this on the diagram, let's say we put 1.1 there, then that's represented by this region to the right of 1.1. And that area there is directly proportional to the probability. Now, when it comes to working out that probability, if we're using tables, then the standardized normal distribution tables just give us the probability of being less than a given value of Z, where Z is greater than zero. So to get around that problem, what we need to do is think of this region here as being all of the whole region minus the area to the left of 1.1. Now the area of the whole region is equal to 1. So what we've got here then is that this is equal to 1 minus the probability of Z being less than 1.1. Okay so it's the whole area minus the area to the left of 1.1 and that would give us the probability of z being greater than 1.1. So we just use our tables and I've got an extract here. You look up your z value of 1.1 under 1.10 and if you look across you should see that you've got 0 0.8643. So we've got that this equals 1 minus 0 0.8643. And if you work that out, you end up with 0 0.1357. And round this to three significant figures, and that's going to be 0 0.136 to three sig figs, 3SF for short then. Okay, well, I hope that's given you an idea then how to do that kind of question if it gave you any problems.